Hi, I'm Ryan Schuler with San Diego.com. It was Mark Twain who said, there's something fascinating about science. Here at the Ruben H. Fleet Center, that's reality. Let's go inside and check it out. We're here at the Ruben H. Fleet Science Center, and right behind me is Geometry Playground. It's our newest exhibition. It's just open uh, this summer, and it'll be here through June of 2011. It's very fun and exciting, and it's doing something that we have never done before. It's making math fun. So visitors of all ages are coming in, and they're uh, seeing that geometry is something that you can move, something you can see, and fit together. And they're doing all of these really fun hands-on things to see how geometry influences their everyday life. This is Kid City. This is one of our permanent exhibitions, and it's just designed especially for kids age five and under. And it's a really exciting place where they can come and uh, learn some of the everyday workings of the world around them. We have tips throughout the exhibit area that um, give suggestions to parents for hands-on interactions they can try with their kids. So it's a really fun experience. Kids just love it here, uh, and we have families that come again and again to enjoy Kid City. So this is our Cellular Journey Exhibition. This was created in-house here at the Ruben H. Leet Science Center, and it explores uh, stem cells and cells of the human body. So it's a great exhibit to sort of have a refresher uh, about human biology and human stem cells, or maybe to, to learn something new. In Balboa Park here, the Ruben H. Leet Science Center, we are the first IMAX dome theater in the world, so that's pretty unique. We show films from everything about climbing Everest to deep under the sea, so it's something for everyone. My name is Mike Lawrence, I'm IMAX projectionist here at the Ruben H. Fleet Science Center for next month will be 19 years. Um, what, what you're seeing right here is the, the film is actually feeding off of the bottom platter. It's going through a set of rollers, it goes up 14 feet through the projector, comes back down the other side and takes up on the left hand side. So when the film's done, we're kind of old school here, we still have to rewind the film back. It takes about 12 minutes to rewind. So. This is uh, about 45 minutes of film. Um, we run shows on the hour, so we'll run this show. And then we'll come up to the top where you can see this one's prepared to run at the top of the hour. Each film on the platter weighs about 230 to 250 pounds. Uh, so we try to keep the A feature on top so we don't have to move it around too much. 70 millimeter film, 15 perforations across. So. To give you an idea, 35 millimeter film, we could fit nine frames inside of one of our frames. This is just the film, the audio is separate, it doesn't run on the film itself, it's actually a digital track upstairs. So this is um, projector number two from IMAX, uh, longest running projector, IMAX projector in the world. It's uh, basically all original. Well, I hope you had as much fun as I did. For more information, visit sandiego.com. Have a good one.